Detroit, are you ready for your main event? Say yeah! Paper Stream, do you agree with the people on hand? Are you prepared? With no further ado, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The green strap is on the Making scene. Making her way out. The WBC. To the blue C corner. World for your main event. Championship. Put your hands on together the line. for Victoria Black Silver. And here she comes. All, all we do is fight time. It's bring you championship out. Championship attitude, championship mentality. And here she is, camouflage. Yeah, she brought that juvenile. This is Sydney LeBlanc, Gretna, Louisiana. Well, Sydney four LeBlanc, one and one. Four one and one. Although she lost her last fight, she's been off for a couple of years. But again, it's because of lack of competition. She says that being that the Olympics are starting to come back around, she's starting to get great competition. Her last fight was in California. So it shows you this young lady is willing to travel for it. Well, she knows she's in here tonight against a very, various, a very, a very serious, I said various, I'm mixing words, Steve, because Miss Clarissa Shields is certainly a, a secret no more to this planet. And her opponent. And Pete Trevino will bring her, her in properly. To the red corner for your main event. Put your hands together for Clarissa Shields. Well, there she is. Talking about the fact that we've seen a lot of hometown cooking. Well, Flip Michigan is about 60 minutes, and there she is, the Olympic champion. Destined for greatness. She let me know, Steve. We sat down with the young lady this week, and she made it very clear. It's more than boxing. It's a ministry. T-Rex. Says she noticed that her opponent was lightweight terrified in the in the way is Steve. Good we talked about that yesterday, so might not be a bad idea. <laughs> we see two gold medals. Two times. Now, let me say this. Ordinarily, usually concerned about the white gloves. Not right now, Steve. Not concerned about the white gloves right now. Not at all. Not at all. Oh, she's got her color things going on. It's time to pay tribute to this great country of ours and all the brave men and women who serve in our armed forces to keep us safe and free. I ask you all now to please stand and remove your hats in honor of our national anthem being performed tonight by Michigan State Fair Superstar Contest winner, Reedy Choi. Oh, so can you see by the dawn's early What so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or oh, the were so gallantly streaming. And the rockets were glad, the bombs bursting in air gave proof to the night that our flag was still there.
Showtime on Fight Time. Drop the mic after. Ladies and gentlemen, this matchup has been sanctioned under the auspices of the State of Michigan Unarmed Combat Commission. Chairman Jeff Styers in attendance. Timekeeper is John Ferran. Cage side position, ringside physicians, Dr. Richard Cross and Dr. Samuel Allen. Judges ringside scoring about Dan Graschuk, Rose Gross, and Ansel Stewart. And the third man in the ring in charge of all the action will be referee Frank Garza. And now, ladies and gentlemen, what time is it, Detroit? It's time for your main event of the evening, introducing your fighters. First, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the camouflage trunks trimmed in black. She comes to the ring sponsored by Mid-City Voodoo Tattoos. Standing five feet, nine inches tall, she weighed in at 164 pounds. Representing Uppercut's gym, she brings with her a record of four wins, one loss, and one draw. Fighting out of and representing Marrero, Louisiana, here is the former IBA heavyweight champion, Victoria Lady Rocky LeBlanc. And her opponent across the ring fighting out of the red corner. Sponsored by Zappos and Minnie Cooper. She is wearing the white trunks trimmed in turquoise. Standing five feet nine inches tall, she weighed in at 162.4 pounds. She comes to the ring representing FWC Burston. Undefeated with a record of two wins and no losses with one big win coming by way of knockout. Fighting out of Flint, Michigan, here is the two-time Olympic gold medalist and reigning NABF middleweight champion, Clarissa T-Rex Shields. And there it is, the Taylor. Garza with me. Yeah, nothing much more to be said. So, so, so if you're the female Rocky, where do you go with this? Stop, well, stop what you have to do is be the aggressor. You got to be first. Me, you can't allow Ladies the whole town this crowd main event to is have any kind of influence the WBC on the judges. You want to take it to Clarissa and see what she got. Wonder WBC if the adrenaline is a lot. Can Clarissa settle in? Right away, let's see what it is. Round one, referee Garza says, let's work. Okay, Shields, right away says, I must do it quick. Wants to let the hands go, right away, okay. Action, too swift to call, hands flying. Ladies working, round one. Can you stand it? Fight time, Clarissa Shields unloads, don't stop. One, two, Lady Rocky could be in trouble, no question. Oh my! Well, she was looking for competition, but she got it tonight. But well, Shields unload with both hands. But LeBlanc did a good job at just weathering that initial storm. And back to work. Settles for a second, catches her breath, and back to it. Every punch, almost flush. Extremely accurate, though it looks like the flurry nation is unleashed. But it's a two-time Olympic champion in here, ladies and gentlemen. Please be advised. She'll look at it right now. Okay. Now wants to be more calculated, Steve. Excellent body work, but the break brings it right back. The combination. LeBlanc still in there has withstood this, but these double-ups, right hands over the top, continuous. 
How many more of these bombs oh, can my. she take? That was the bomb. Oh, my. The left, the right. Oh, my. Men don't want to feel this, Steve. Men do not want to feel this kind of pressure. The Lady Rocky standing in there, though, I dare I say, I have to believe her name because Balboa would take these type of shots, too. To the amazement of Shields, I can't believe you're still standing up. So I will give you more. Left time. Right time. Left time. Ten seconds. No. Right time. Low, low, high. Right, left, right. Let's Bell ring, too much. All the punches. Can we count them? I think 175 punches just flew right now. I'm not sure. Where's CompuBox when you Everybody need them? Noise, Make a deal, Shears. Make a, Shears. Deal. Make a deal. deal. Round one Number is complete. Two. Wow. Uh, well, round one is in the book, and we know who won that round. But you know, you said left time, right time, left, no, fight time. It's That's what indeed. that just was. I was just setting it up. I was just setting it up. I was going there. I didn't want to spoon feed the arch, Steve. You know, I just wanted to walk them in. It's like when you write a song. I don't want to spoon feed it to them. They knew. They knew. They knew. So the party's underway at this point. Round two, what will that bring? And, and as you have, the, now, Steve, as you have the hitman sitting ringside, it takes you back to the way that you do a round one. Only round one in history, superior to Second every round out, one out. in the history, Make some noise. was yeah. the Throw hitman and the marvelous the one. T-Rex said she wanted to go ahead and bid for the campaign of round one onslaught, round two. What will you do, T-Rex? What is this? Okay, jabs with precision right now. Okay, right hand now. Oh my, the combinations, very fast. The hands look fast. They look real fast. She says, okay, she's leaning right now. Uh-oh, we're going to work now downstairs. Le Le LeBlanc's got to turn this into a street fight. She and, just can't and, stand and there And that's all it is, and that's all it can be. But LeBlanc, you admire the heart, knowing she's receiving this punishment. And it is excessive, to say the least. These punches are precise. The target is evident, and it is clearly being obliterated. As we can see, double up, left time to your forehead. Where you want it? Okay, uppercut now. What you got next, Shields? Okay, still with the jab. Right. Fierce now. And that jab is very stiff. Oh, the right hand shoot it straight. Her and Tommy Hearns worked on that. We have that on tape, Steve. We have this on tape. Female Rocky still uppercut. walking ahead, though. Just like Balboa would do it, though. Just like he would do it. It's looking like Apollo Shields in here, though. This looks like the first Rocky fight, though, the first movie. Oh, look at it. Downstairs, right up top, in rhythm. Look at this. Oh, oh my goodness. Shot after shot. Well, Double with the left. I mean, she's loading them up. Really scoring with pretty much everything she's throwing Everything right now. she's throwing. Oh, my. The hook right there. Off the ribs, to the cheek, back to the temple. Oh, my. Let it loose. Right hand, anytime you want it. Watch this. Watch her fly up. Like, watch the hands go off this. Watch this. Go ahead. Here we go. Bink, 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 bink. Sound like that machine in the Lynch basement. Bink, 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 bink. LeBlanc doing a good job at trying to fight off them ropes. She's Bitcoining her. She's Bitcoining. That's how I do. Bing, bing, bing. Oh, my. That's two rounds. Oh, she said, let's hug her. No, I'm, no, I'm trying I'm to no hug. She said, that's it. Uh -huh. I don't know if she'll be back out, Steve. I don't know. After round two, I'm not sure the female Rocky. Oh, she's coming back out. She's coming out because I saw her wave off the corner. I don't know. I don't know. I, we might have to take an over under on this on the time before we see something. She, 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 wanted, she wanted to show a little love. There's a talk right and, now. There's a discussion. And Shields is like, what love got to do with it? Right. Yeah. Absolutely. Everything yeah. she's throwing is with bad intention. I mean, I'm very impressed at the power she generates from her shots. I mean, and, and, and Steve, can we telling. call it this? Let me make up, dare I make up a new terminology again here? Reckless precision. Rec can you, can you have, can we have reckless precision, Steve Taylor? Because we it, saw it. Well, we treat, yeah, and, I, and we're gonna see some more. Okay, well, if you wanna scream it out then, Rocco, let's go, Rocco. You're all hard, Rock. Let's get it. Here we go. You got to have it with the Rex. Okay, what are we doing? Round three. I didn't really want to be out here. I feel bad. It's hurting me right now. I'm really hurt. My chest hurts. Uh-oh, look at this. Okay. Covered up, though, with the arms right now. 
Not quite. Shields looking for the... There it is. Looking for the lane. She keeps finding the lane, that right hand all day. She goes up a cut, comes left. Still in the fight, though. Female Rocky is a quality opponent under these circumstances, to say the least. She definitely is. Who can deal with this? Can anybody deal with this? But she's doing it. And Shields is giving it. Championship boxing on fight time. It's a habit. That's all it is, Steve Taylor. What you said is a habit. That's all we do around here. Oh, look at the right hand. Oh, my. And Oh, my. Oh, these right. Oh, my. Well, if you're sitting ringside, you can just hear the thunderous shots. You can shots. hear the thunderous shots. Downstairs. Downstairs. Dig. Look at her. Now the dig. Is it gold somewhere nearby? They do a lot of gold exchange here in Detroit, so I guess he's digging for that left hook game. Right. Oh, my. Bye. Power. Oh, it's right here on top of us. It's right here on top of us. How? I mean, you. I mean, you can't love anything more than that. Two ladies on top of you, Steve Taylor, Just and you gotta love it. Throwing bombs. Oh my! The way we like it too. Two ladies on top throwing bombs. Bing, fight time. The only place you will hear that. Please don't check for another network because you don't need to go anywhere else. Clarissa Shields is here. James Tony's here. Zab Judah. Everybody. And who's coming next? Robert Easter Jr. You Vegas. saw that. Deontay Wilder, look at it, fancy. She says, why you naming names, Drake? I'm showing out. I see you. I just wanted to keep it real plural. Oh, oh, another bell. Will we see a fourth? Because we've seen three, and I can't believe it. So we'll have a seat and take a quick break. Oh, my. This is what we do. Fight time thanks you. We thank you. Well, I, well, I we thank you for the fun four. that you're having watching this. Savvy Sinclair, Steve Taylor, here with you ringside at the Masonic Temple, live from the 313. Please understand that. What up, dog? Detroit, planet Earth. So we move ahead, and stunningly, we are approaching the fourth round of this and how this young lady, Sydney LeBlanc, has endured Second this out. onslaught Make some noise, Detroit. for 12 oh. minutes. Yeah, it's tough. It's is tough. unbeknownst to and, me. And, and, and I tell you, she's showing no signs of letting up. Walks back out like Balboa would do. She is the Lady Rocky. In case you just joined us. Back to business. Clarissa Shields. In case you didn't catch this, is a two-time Olympic champion, meaning two gold medals. Everybody does not do that. How do we know? Because it's never been done before. But what she's doing now is dropping these lefts and rights like she did before. Work. Downstairs, upstairs. We've seen it all night. Over the top, underneath, hook game, power punching. Summer Blast. Look at her. Center of the ring now. Showing out. Hands gone. Letting them fly. Hooks everywhere. Well, this young lady, LeBlanc, has a, she has some chin because she continues to take them and walks forward. She's a tank. She's a tank, clearly. And she's now, still slugging away. Now offering in return. Shields. Right hand, nothing but power. Again, nothing but power. Left hand, left hand, left hand. To the head, to the body, back to the body, back to the cheek. Clarissa Shields gave the people she's exactly what they asked exactly for. Exactly what she's doing. Putting on the show for the hometown fans. Le oh, my. Excellent uppercut. That one sends it. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Blank. Putting it on. Exhausted right now. Shields content to continue to drive lefts and rights Five to of the them face in the books. of Sidney LeBlanc. 
But Richard Shields, ladies and gentlemen, five rounds. This is of All out. Round number Heat five. Seeking. I got it four. Issues. I've got it four Heat rounds to none. For Richard Shields. It's been all it's been all shields. 40 to 36 shields. And there's certainly no need to consult about that or caucus in any way. The question at this point seconds out, seconds out. is what How about if Detroit makes some noise? the finish looks like. But once again, as you mentioned, Steve, look at her. Right to the center of the ring is the female Rocky. Her name is Sydney LeBlanc, and you have certainly got to tip your cap to her, even at this juncture. Left hands, still plentiful. There's a right. Okay. A retort now. From LeBlanc. Straight right, then again, off the movement with the left. And what you like is how she's starting to move her opponent around, changing punch, punching angles. She just loses the mouthpiece. We'll have a momentary pause. From the neutral corners, we resume. Shields, center of the ring, work. Hands flying again. Completely reckless precision. I tell you, one thing we've learned is LeBlanc can take a punch. Oh, my. To say the least, Steve Taylor. And she continues she, to come she, forward. She's earned these people respect no matter how this thing wraps up. Everyone will applaud this effort from both ladies in this ring. And when you say main event, who says that the ladies can't hold down oh, the foundation? They're definitely holding serve. Look at this now. The, the block's got to let her still hands in the go. Fight. Still in the fight. She's got to let her hands go. She just can't allow Shields to sit there and pick punches. If she has an advantage, she's got to take advantage of it. But that's, I mean, that's tough saying, deep. Being it, you're having a lot of those lefts and rights bounce off your face. And, and the onslaught continues as, as well described by Brother Taylor. Clarissa Shields continues to perform surgery. Sidney LeBlanc continues to absorb punishment, but does it as though it's a walk in the park. Oh, on the bell. Woo! So there's that, Steve. Just over... Halfway as we approach round six. I must say, wasn't sure we'd get here. So credit to again to Miss LeBlanc God. in that regard. Look, you know what? Sydney's done a good job. I mean, really, the deck was kind of stacked against her. Absolutely. Coming in here, facing a hostile crowd. Check one a two-time Olympic champion. Check two. And then the fact that she hasn't had any action for the last two, four years. The worst check of all. You know, looking for competition. Well, she's definitely found Seconds it tonight. Out. Her hands First are full. Seconds out. You know, my hat goes off to Sydney LeBlanc, but looks like oh, Ms. Shields has all the answers to the questions. And that's always a problem when you take that test. Here we go. Clarissa Shields. Spark throughout. Electricity. We assured you you would get it. Now you have it. And Fight Time appreciates you being here to witness it. With everyone here in the Masonic Temple. Body work, back to the dome. Body work, back to the dome. 
And the block just takes it, walks forward. And Shields continues to administer punishment. Scoring to the body with both hands. Demonstrating what Hart really looks like. That's Sidney LeBlanc. Yeah, Please she... understand that because nobody wants this. I really don't know a lot of gentlemen who want to stand in front of this. Oh, that is a looping right hand that had to really sizzle the temple. But, but it's not to turn LeBlanc, but she continues to press. T-Rex now looking to make a signature, another one of those right hands. Shields content to wait now. Picking his shot, knowing it's wrapping up. Look at this, Steve. Look at the unload. Look at the unload. Look at the unload. Feeling good to her. It's like she's having, it's joyous. The look on her face. Woo! Clarissa Shields, ladies and gentlemen. Do you see her on fight time? Do you see her on fight time? You got the stream? Do you see it? And for all of you watching it on the video de on demand, thank you very much. Please tell a friend that they need to order this and watch this young lady perform. You know, Sam, I'm not quite sure what I'm more impressed by. The performance of Clarissa Shields, or the heart right. and the grittiness well said, being Steve performed Taylor. by Sidney LeBlanc. It's all good. But then again, you're on fight time. Yeah. What in the world did you expect, my friend? You have to fight. That's what we, that's what we are doing here. Seconds out, seconds out. Round number seven, Detroit makes some noise. T. Christmas time. Round seven, ladies and gentlemen, of eight in the middleweight division. The WBC Silver Super title on the line. Clarissa Shields, Olympic champion. Sydney LeBlanc, female Rocky, has shown you why she has earned the name. Look at this. Shields again with all of the answers and LeBron trying to change the questions to no avail. It's been all Shields all night. She digs another left hand to the body. And fires again with the jab and triples. And for those of you unaware, though, the thing about this, Steve, let me add to, dare I say, the legend of the female Rocky who took this fight in less than a week's notice. On five days' notice. So please understand that, ladies and gentlemen. And you get in here with a two-time Olympic champion and a current champion at that. We haven't mentioned enough that the NABF champ is still in there against Miss LeBlanc. All of that, and you are in here in her building with her people. You're right, Steve Taylor. I don't know which one we celebrate. You, 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 you hold them up, dare I say, in equal regard. Well, you know, in, in LeBlanc's defense, when you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. Shout out to Sugar Free. Young people, Google that. And there it is. Seven rounds. Seven rounds in the book. Of pure uh, adulterated destruction. Administered from one Clarissa T-Rex Shields. Eighth and final round. Hats off to that woman right there. Sydney LeBlanc, Louisiana's finest. Round number eight. Ring card girl representing the undercover. Now, Steve, could Miss Shields. 
Don't forget to tune in every Tuesday B. from 7 to 9 p.m. I don't know. Could she be caught? This woman, could she be caught, Steve? She can't. Is that, there, is that even possible at this stage of the game with be, a person like this? She can't be undisciplined right now. Cannot be. Is that what I was going for? Okay, thank you, sir. She I cannot. knew I was on the right track. Because here's the lady. Make some noise. That's going to let it all hang out. She had every right defense. to quit. And if she yeah, ain't went about, down. About 15 minutes ago. And if she ain't quit by now. Eighth and final round. She ain't going nowhere. Apparently not. So let's watch the conclusion, ladies and gentlemen. You are welcome, folks. Fight time is honored to bring you the truth in boxing. Look at it. Busy. Ladies. Beautiful. And tougher than you, sir. Look at this. These women have fought like this from the opening bell and it's been for eight rounds, 24 minutes of destruction. And the punishment that Sydney LeBlanc has taken, she continues to press forward and throw punches. This fight would actually be crazy. If, if this fight was 12 or, or, or like old school days, 15 see, rounds, 15 rounds yeah. we would see that dramatic shift, I guarantee you. Because Shields has put in a ton of work here as she looks to finish this signature style like an Olympic champion would do. Mr. Block working to hear that bell yeah, well, my as, as, as Rocky would do. <laughs> my question to you, if you're Shields, do you get discouraged because you haven't been able to do any damage? Very interesting question and, and almost a fair one. As impressive as she's looked, she certainly was expecting to get the opponent out of there early. She commented on that during the media sessions this week. But I do think if we were to ask her at the end of the day, that W will be just fine. It'll be just fine. And with the work that you're putting in. Because she wasn't sure if she would get that work. But she did get it. Well, she's getting she, it. She definitely got it. As we round in the home. Let me be the first one on my feet. First one on my feet. That's what we see. That's what we mean. I'm supposed to be objective, but I'm not. That's I'm biased. I'm biased, Steve Taylor. That was beautiful, ladies. Beautiful. Fight time thanks you. Dylan Shears, we might have to write these ladies a check after this. I don't know what to say. Unbelievable. Thank you very much for that. Thank you, everybody on this Salida promotion. Dimitri, you have done it, sir. You have done it. Clarissa Shields, very impressive. Nothing short of what you might expect from a two-time Olympic champion, NABF middleweight champion, looking to claim the WBC silver middleweight title here in a few minutes. Yeah. Sydney LeBlanc gave you as an impressive performance as you can have facing a monster like that. 80 72 is what I had it scored. Total shutout for Clarissa. But my hat is tipped to Miss Sydney LeBlanc because she had every right to tap out. She didn't. True and she fought indeed. to that final bell. Silly LeBlanc has had to have earned everyone's respect. And I would have to admit, I'm excited for the woman to actually be able to display this performance. Because that woman across the ring from her is probably going to knock out almost anyone she, she faces, fights. Steve yeah. Taylor. Yeah. So Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a big round of applause for your main event fighters. And they say there are no moral victories. Sidney LeBlanc got one. Clarissa Shields, hats off to you. With me in the ring, I have WBC chairwoman Jill Diamond to present your winner with the belt. No, After real. eight rounds of professional boxing, all three judges score this contest 80 to 72 for your winner by unanimous decision and new WBC Silver Super Middleweight Champion,
Clarissa T-Rex Shields. Clarissa T-Rex Shields, your new silver super middleweight champion as well as the NABF All champion. All right, ladies and gentlemen, before we get to Clarissa, and I'm undefeated. Give the microphone to Victoria LeBlanc for two seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, put a big round of applause together. What a perfect name, Lady Rocky, everybody. Coming right here from Louisiana to take on our champion, Clarissa Shields. Thank you for coming out, Victoria. Do you have anything you want to say to our crowd? Thank you for bringing out a good Olympian. A gold medalist, women's boxing needs it. We got a lot of women on the shelf that need opponents. I'm one of them. We've been boxing for 10, 15 years and we never had opponents in like three, four years. So thank you, Clarissa. She's a monster and I don't fight anything less but monsters. So proud. You are yeah, great, Lady well Rocky, said. let me tell you. We love you here in Detroit. And Clap then she just killed him with that, Steve. Victoria LeBlanc. Well done. Certainly, we, we applaud this well woman. Done. Thank now, you. Well done. Thank you, Miss LeBlanc. In the thank center you. Of the ring and now the champ. With Let's your hear from new the champ. champion, baby. WBC Silver, Super Middleweight Champion, T Rex Clarissa Shields. How you feeling, girl? Uh, I feel good. Um, first, I want to thank my opponent for coming out. You know, three days notice, she supposed to have a fight June 10th, and hers got canceled, so she was in shape. And she definitely was training hard, and she lasted all eight rounds. So I thank her for coming, and uh, we can give my uh, fans and my family, a, uh, fan, fans and friends and supporters and fans, everybody a good, a good boxing show, women's boxing. I've never had a belt before that got my face on it, you know what I mean, it's different. And, uh, you know, I want to thank everybody for coming out. I want to thank Flint, Detroit. Um, you know, we got, we got Tommy Hearns in the building. We got Zab Judah, my man that played Biggie in the house. You know, we brought out some stars tonight. And, uh, you know, I always got to give a shout out to God and just thank my team, you know, thank my coach, uh, thank my teammates, Baby G and Quan for coming out. And my coach, uh, you know, Ed Kendall, I want to thank my manager, Mark Taffet, and my agent, Jamie, uh, Jamie Fritz, for just always getting behind me, even though I have some different ways at times. Uh, we all make it work and we're all a good team. And I just want to thank everybody for coming out. And, uh, you know, come and see me fight for the actual WC belt August 4th. Right. That sounds good to us. We support you. We love you here in Detroit and in Flint. I'm sure all over. Congratulations to you, Clarissa. Oh, and sorry. Shout out to my promoter, Salida Promotion, Dimitri. Thank you. <laughs> there you have it. Your WBC Silver Super Middleweight Champion, Clarissa. T-Rex Shields. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, another one in the books. Detroit, Michigan this time, the Masonic Temple. That does it for us here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. It's been Everybody a fine show, ladies and gentlemen. And again, Hotel. We cannot offer enough thanks and appreciation bit. to everybody involved with this production, uh, the promotion. Salinta, yes. our, our friends over there, Dimitri, yes. thank you for having us, brother. Yes. Doing business, strategic partnership, we appreciate that. The city of Detroit, always showing fight time love from day one. We thank you. We thank you. All the champions in the building tonight, as the young lady mentioned, Tommy Hur, Zab Judah. Milt McQuarrie. Milt McQuarrie, of course, before the hitman. Bronco McCarthy. Uh, Our man Jamal Wooler, like Wooler, like she said, playing Biggie in the Tupac situation. Play Biggie and Notorious. He's in the building. We, we star studded. Sidney LeBlanc. Our boys and, and lovely ladies, very talented in the truck. All of you don't want to screw up anyone's name, but certainly can't thank you enough. Amy Harmon Detroit bro. on social media. I'm Detroit Knuckles. Again. Detroit Knuckles. We're just Check grateful. YouTube at Boxing Cap on the YouTube. Vegas team. Search Fight Boxing Time. Head. Fight Time Ohio, Toledo. Fight Time Nationwide. And don't forget to get that fight time. We appreciate you. Pete Trevino. The man on the mic. So ladies and gentlemen, we thank you again. We're humbled as we are every time. We would like to thank our creator as always for without his power, without the power, we cannot be in power and demonstrate peace through power. That's fight time, ladies and gentlemen.
So for Steve Taylor, ladies and gentlemen, once again, my name is Savvy Sinclair. We look forward to the next time we can get together. Again, it's been a pleasure. Live stream. We call it paper stream. Paper stream. We'll see you on the next one, ladies and gentlemen. K9 is up next, Dearborn. We'll see you when we get back. Peace. Thank you. Good night, ladies and gentlemen. Fight Time Live.